Hello everyone, today I'm bringing you a little tutorial to learn how to draw Vegeta in a chibi style. Grab a sheet of paper, a pencil, and let's get started. A quick tip, don't hesitate to pause the video if needed as you draw along. With your pencil, start by drawing three lines spaced five centimeters apart. Then a line in the middle. In the top section, we'll draw the classic circle, which will later become the head. It touches the top line but leaves a few millimeters of space from the middle line. About halfway down the circle, draw a curved line, then, about halfway between the first curved line and the bottom of the circle, draw a second curved line. On these curved lines, draw rectangles that will later contain the eyes. Now, below the horizontal middle line, draw two circles, these will be the shoulders. Connect them with a line. This will be our shoulder line. About halfway between the two lower horizontal lines, draw a small line. Under the circles, draw a small trapezoid that goes through the small middle line. At the two lower ends of the trapezoid, draw small ovals, which will be the hips. Now from the hips, draw the same lines as I do, which will later become the legs. We're going to make Vegeta with his arms crossed. So from the shoulders, draw the same lines as I do, which will be the arms. Now at the eye level, we're going to break our circle a bit, with small oblique lines on each side of the eyes. Then we'll go up along the skull and extend it slightly above the top line, because the skull isn't really round. It's more like a large oval, somewhat flattened on the sides. Add the shape of the ears, roughly at the eye level. There you go. The result should look something like this. Don't hesitate to pause to improve your sketch before moving on to the next step. Now I recommend softening your lines with an eraser so that they're still visible and can guide you in constructing Vegeta. For this part, you'll still need your pencil. Start with the neck in the middle, not too thick, going from the bottom of the circle to the middle line. Then draw small lines to the shoulders. Outline the shoulders. Then start the top of Vegeta's outfit. Begin the right eye with the eyebrow, then do the same on the left side. Under the eyebrows, 
You can draw the shape of the eyes. The nose. Very small because it's Chibi Vegeta. And the mouth with his confident smile. And finally, the inside of the eyes. On the forehead, add Vegeta's characteristic little marks. Now, you're going to refine the lower part of Vegeta's face, keeping the Dragon Ball style by slightly breaking the roundness. You can now start the crossed arms. Don't forget the gloves. Outline the torso, then the legs, and finally the feet, with the characteristic shoes of Frieza's soldiers. Now start on the hair, beginning at the forehead with Vegeta's signature V, then the temple's outlines, you can now draw all his hair ending in spikes, watch closely how I do it and don't hesitate to pause if needed. Oh, and I almost forgot the inside of the ears.
And there you have it, the final pencil sketch. Now I suggest we watch the inking and coloring sped up until the final result. A quick tip for the hair. I chose the right side for the light source. If you look closely, you'll see that I left more white on Vegeta's right side to give a sense of volume with the lighting. And here's the final result. Feel free to tell me what you think in the comments. And if you found this video useful and interesting, I invite you to subscribe and hit the like button. It's always appreciated. Have a great day, and keep drawing every day, you'll make progress.